Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, I thought I would do a what's in my bag video because I've seen a lot of people doing videos like that and I think it's quite interesting to see what's in someone's handbag. It's, it's like really weird the things you actually find and my bag is full of stuff so I can't wait to show you what's in there. So first of all, this is my bag. It's from Michael Kors. I love it so much. Hope you can see it all. The back. So I got this bag for my Christmas in 2015 and my boyfriend got me it as a present and oh my god I oh, I cried so much when I got this and I was like oh, I thought it was the sweetest thing ever like oh, I've always wanted a Michael Kors bag and I finally have it just the best thing in the world so I'm so happy with it it's the only bag I use just because I don't like having different bags obviously when I go out clubbing or whatnot I'll have like a little clutch but apart from that this is like my main bag so I'm just gonna start off with things in the front <laughs> so this is obviously the first thing um this is from North Highland College this is from when I went to a careers fair in Wick and this is just from the little college stand and I just thought I would just grab some mints, you know. It was free so why not? <laughs> so I've got a few pens and pencils Um, this is just for work. It's always work related and um, I always need something to write with and so I keep plenty in my bag. So much rubbish in here. I've got... Ooh, I've got a lot of, um, this is my holidays that I've taken from work, so I've got those here, and I also have a few bus tickets that, of the bus tickets, you're just going to lie in your bag, you know, you're shoving them and you forget, then you look through and like, why have I got so many bus tickets? So I've got a few bus tickets, I probably have more in my bag somewhere. Of course, I've got a bus pass, yeah. Nothing interesting, just a plain old first bus pass. Oh, if you live in Aberdeen, you'll know first. I'm not sure if anybody else or anywhere has a first bus as um, their bus. What's it called? Their bus company. Yeah, there's different bus companies. So in Aberdeen, there's like stagecoach and first bus, which is first bus is just like the main bus. I would assume. I got a padlock. This is for my gym locker because you know it's so annoying. I like the lockers where you just put a pound in and it works like and you just get a key. What kind of like maybe this is better I don't know. I least I get the keeper. And I've got some keys so this one is for um, my boyfriend's door at home and these two are for the lock and um, not this lock another lock but it's just like that one and this key here is uh, my locker key for work oh and of course a lighter like I feel like you can't go anywhere with a lighter you never know what you're gonna need it for either you're gonna use it to smoke on fireworks day for the sparklers say someone needs a, a lighter for birthday candles I'm sorted any any kind of candle you always need a lighter I feel lighters are really handy and I've got another padlock and a set of keys I'm, I don't know what which key is what I don't know why I haven't even got two padlocks but there you go plenty so now so now we're going to move into the inside. I'll show you what it looks like if I can. Ooh. I don't know if you can see that. So this is just the inside of my bag. So I've got like a zip bit at the back there. Then like a compartment here. I've got like little bits and bobs in there too. And then I've got a middle bit that zips and then just the front bit 
This bag is so heavy. I don't even know how I even carry this every day. I, literally, I don't even need anything in this bag except for like my purse usually and my keys. I literally take this bag with me everywhere. And it's such so heavy. Like, I don't even know why I even take it with me, but whatever. So I'm just gonna reach into this pocket. <laughs> I got some soothers. These are really Look, they look really old. I think I've only had them since winter, but it looks like they've been sitting there for so long. Like, it looks so gross. I've got the I Love Cadonas band. Um, yeah, this is from Cadonas, and if you don't live in Aberdeen, um, that is our, like, fun park. So you can do games outside, like rides, and there's mini golf, there's a cinema beside it the, um there's bowling it's just like arcade games like if you're like watching from like america or anywhere else it's just like a place to go like a family fun center place and i got that band for student bowling Woo! it's cheap bowling monday nights gotta do it and this is my sd card slot thing that i use to upload my footage onto my laptop because my laptop has a bit where you can put like an SD card into it, but for some reason, like I think it must just be the SD card I've got. It doesn't work with the laptop either. It doesn't work. Like the bit in the laptop doesn't work, or it's just like the wrong kind of card for the laptop. So I had to buy something extra to put my footage onto my laptop so I can edit and upload for you guys. So this is my second pocket. What have I got here? Oh, what's our receipt? Is it? Oh, is this for Morrison's? What did I buy? I... Huh? I can't remember buying it. I bought Mentos. I don't buy Mentos. Weird. Oh, I've got these... Things. I don't know what these are. I think you're meant to exchange these for tickets. And then you can get like a prize for it, but I didn't really get much, and I just thought they were cool, so I just took them home with me. Cause it's like a whole machine full of them. It's like, oh, weird. And I've got another I Love Cadonas band, cause of course I forget mine's at home when I go bowling. So it's just a pound to buy another one, so it wasn't a big deal. So this is my purse. Love it. It's from New Look. And I think it was about 15 pounds or so. Um, I did um, get a gift card for like a present or my, I think it was my birthday or my Christmas or something. I must have been Christmas. I'm pretty sure I haven't had this for that long, but yeah, it was around, wait, maybe 15 pounds? Actually, I think it might have been 10 pound, but I'm not 100% sure. I needed a new purse at the time and as you can see in there, it is full of stuff. Nice cards. I'm not going to show you inside my purse because that's personal. Yay! Fun part. These are some sunglasses. I've had these for about like three or four years and they're still going strong. I love them. Love print is just my favorite. Oh, oh, these are so good. I got these from International. Um, this is just a shop that like used to be in Aberdeen, but they're not in Aberdeen anymore. But they had all the best stuff, like the sunglasses, clothes. They were so good. I'm so gutted they actually closed down. I don't know why. Why have they closed down? It don't make no sense. They're good. <laughs> so of course you can't have your handbag without a little snack. So. I shoved these in here the other day, they're not janky, like, they look minging, but just some plain old crackers from Jacobs. Um, yeah, I just, I just bought some crackers that I shoved in my bag because I needed a snack, and I haven't eaten them yet, of course. But, and they're like, all broken up, so I probably should eat them sometime soon. Of course, you cannot live in Scotland without an umbrella. I feel like it is, it is essential. It is the top priority to have an umbrella in your handbag if you're in Scotland because you don't even know what the weather is ever going to be like. One minute it's a bright sunny outside, the next minute it's pouring down of rain. It's just like 
literally you get all seasons in one day in this place it is mental so it has to be lacquer print like i love this umbrella you just press a button and it just pops out and it's just perfect then you don't have to struggle it's a struggle to close it but it's not a struggle to open it so i really like this umbrella um this is from h&m this is where that is where i get all my umbrellas from sorry that is bradley you know messaging me <laughs> but yeah um H&M is just really good umbrella. I really love going there. And yeah, it's just a uh, umbrella. So we have another pair of sunglasses. I just recently got these for my holiday. So I went in a pair of like these from Topshop and they were like key sunglasses. And of course, they didn't have any in stock because when I went to buy them, they were on sale and it, it was obviously low stock. And then I get an email saying, Oh, your order's been cancelled and I phoned them and they said oh sorry we're out of stock and I was like oh, really so I really wanted them and good old Primark came up with these and I saw them and I fell in love and yeah these were £3 from Primark and I just fell in love because they're literally this spitting image of the sunglasses that I wanted and I know a lot of people don't like Primark sunglasses because they think that the UV doesn't really work well on the actual thing but I don't it doesn't bother me like I feel like it dims the light enough for my eyes to control and to move to with the light <laughs> that even that doesn't make any sense but if it makes sense to you then great you need to know what I'm talking about but yeah I absolutely love these sunglasses and they just oh, I got them for holiday I'm going in September and I just love them I cannot wait to use them another lighter of course so as with the umbrella you can't go around Scotland without having a pair of gloves I don't use these obviously because it's summer but in winter these are always on me and I don't like, like I said I don't have another bag this is the only bag I use so I just feel that there's no point in removing them because I'm gonna wear them eventually anyway, so just leave it in there. Ah, uh, tissue used. I've got this perfume, it's called Euphoria by Calvin Klein. Oh, look at the bottle, it is so cute. And the perfume smells amazing. Like, my mom bought me this for my birthday, which was in May, and oh my god. I love it. It smells like something she used to wear and I just it just brings on memories and I love it so much. And I also have a lip balm. And um, this is the Nivea Hydro Care and it's got SPF 15 in it. I always, always, always need a lip balm in my handbag because like my lips are always dry and I don't know why. Like even in summer, winter, it doesn't matter what time of day it is. I always have dry lips and I cannot go out well a lip balm so that's just a must. So moving into the middle section I've got equipment like imagine this like of course I've got equipment like I don't even know where to put my equipment so I just leave it in my handbag it's just ridiculous. So this is just a Toshiba hard drive so I usually save all my videos on this. I haven't done it like I haven't done it in a while so I will need to transfer all my videos from my laptop to this so I know it's safe. And this is just my um, camera charger. This sits in my bag too. I usually have my camera in my um, little gorilla pod in my bag too, but I'm using it today, so it's not in my bag, but it's usually in my bag. I've got a Sony camera. I don't know what make it is, but it's just a cheap camera. Okay, so we're nearly there. So I've got a packet of tissues because my eyes are always watering or my nose is always running. Literally, there's no winning in this place. Like, especially in... Oh, don't even let me get started. Hay fever. I'll come back, actually come back to that later. I, I've got the worst hay fever. This is really, what's one reason I hate summer? I've got these horrible floss. Like, this, this floss is horrible. I don't like flossing my teeth. My dentist says I need to start flossing my teeth. And I put this in my teeth and it gets stuck. Like, I don't know what is wrong with my teeth, but it gets stuck in my teeth and I can't use these. 
So I'm gonna have to give them to someone or just throw them away because they're of not no use to me. So I've got a few letters. Oh. So I've got one, two, three. I've got <laughs> I've got three letters here. Of course, like when I used to go from my mom to boyfriend's house, they used to just come pick my letters and shove them back. And then clearly, I've just left them there. Like, does anyone know what to do with letters? I don't have a clue what to do with letters. They, do you store them? Do you throw them away? What? Like, I don't know. I just leave them in my bag or somewhere else. I've also got some pay slips, which kind of match my background. <laughs> if you can see. Yeah, it's just my pay slips from work. So I've got, this is a little ticket from Kodona's, rubbish. This hand cream, this is the Moringa hand cream and this is from the body shop. This is actually really good, it smells good. I've got the shower milk, not the shower milk, the body milk, like the body lotion but it's like a milk. It's really good, I like the smell of it. Another manky tissue, I probably should clean my bag, this is gross. <laughs> Um, nail clippers. I can't believe it. I've got the most random stuff in my bag ever. Oh. Um, a Kleenex thing. There's no tissues in it. A thing from work. This is my old badge for when I was at the checkout. In my trusty inhaler. If I can't breathe, this is what I use. So this is just in the side pockets now. I've got tweezers. I feel like every girl should have a pair of tweezers no matter where she is. It's on the go. What if you need like an eyebrow plucked or just something wrong and you need tweezers? Like you got a splinter. Take tweezers. Pick. You're sorted. A nail file. Don't know. This is just random. I don't know why it's in the bag. I just leave everything in my bag, of course. Nail polish, this is a Rimmel one, um, I don't know what it's called, it all came off, of course, it's just life, I guess. <laughs> oh, I hope you are all finding this interesting, I feel like this is a really random video and I, I'm actually quite fun looking through my bag, I'm trying to clear it out. I've got this thing I used to use for the self-checkout that Morrison's when I was on the checkout, I was operator 33 but now my number doesn't work in the till anymore and I'm really sad because I've not even left the company yet and my number doesn't work. I think it's really weird. So nearly there. So I've got some tablets. Nurofen. If you have a headache, this is perfect. Ooh, I've got some more. I've got more Nurofen. Every girl needs to have these in their bag. If you don't know what this is, I'm not even going to say it because every girl should know it. And every girl should have those in their bags because you never know when the time might come and you're in like, Ugh, you're like, I need it. Because it happened, like, it's happened to me. People have asked me if I've had any and if I haven't and it's really important because anyone might need it and the girls, we got to stick together for those girly things. <laughs> oh, and we have some more Nurofen in the hay fever tablets. Yeah, I have the worst hay fever ever. And oh my god, every single summer I suffer so much. It is so not fair. I don't know why it happened. Like, if I don't take these tablets, sometimes I have to take two. And you're only meant to take one. Sometimes they don't even work. And I'm like, oh my god, this whole, the whole day I'll be suffering. I'll not have a clue what to do it is just awful like these are the tablets I take these are called fexofenadine hydrochloride and these work magic and you can only get them from the doctor and they once you get from the store is usually okay but they're quite expensive and they're really small like these ones are huge and you get so many from them from the doctor so I would just recommend getting a prescription from the doctor because it's free if you're in the UK NHS come on guys nobody can be bothered going to buy all this stuff from the pharmacy like I can't afford this it's just ridiculous and finally the last thing is a receipt And this is from Game, and this is when I want to buy Bradley at Game. 
yeah, I bought him, like, it says X1, so there's an Xbox One, PC, there's like a, a rainbow, some, if there's any guys watching this, if you know anything about rainbow something, the game's like £35, and this has a disc here, which was um, £1, so that means, I think it means like, if the disc got scratched or ruined and I think you can get it cleaned or fixed for free or something. I don't know. Well, it's just it was one pound anyways. I thought it would be worth it just in case. But of course, he doesn't even play it anymore. And I got these um, controller pads as well, which he doesn't even use. And I'm like, I spent eight pound on this, and it doesn't even work. I never used them. Like, what a waste of money. But yeah. So that's everything in my bag guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video, I had lots of fun actually looking through my bag and seeing what there is in it, so now I can just go through all this mess that's in front of me and just put things in my bag that I actually need there and just keep everything else somewhere else, so thank you guys for watching again, if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Yeah, if you have any comments and what I can do in the future, just please leave them down below in the comments bar. It will really help me because sometimes I really struggle to think of what to film because I don't just like filming makeup tutorials. I like filming other videos and I feel like this video here today is really good. It's nice to just sit down and chat. You can get to know me a little bit better, know my personality. And now you know what's in my bag. So there you go. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.